and head straight to Parliament, where the Finance Minister has amended the 2020 budget barely 24 hours after the Volta caucus of the minority demanded inclusion of deplorable roads in the Volta region, which were conspicuously uh, missing in the budget. Well, the Finance Minister Ken Furiata insists his attention was drawn to the omission by the Volta Regional Minister and not the minority. It's good, it's good to be back. Right Honorable Speaker, thank you most sincerely uh, for, for this opportunity to make a statement in this August House today. On Wednesday, 13th November 2019, I presented the 2020 Budget Statement and Economic Policy of the Government of Ghana on behalf of His Excellency the President of the Republic of Ghana. Following my presentation to this August House, the Honorable Volta Regional Minister and the Honorable Minister for Energy drew my attention to an omission of Volta Region from the list of critical roles listed in Table 21 of the Budget Statement. My checks confirm, Mr. Speaker, the inadvertent omission of Volta Region. All the Regional Ministers, Mr. Speaker, were requested to submit a list of critical roads which required immediate attention. At the instance of the Volta Regional Minister, three road projects in the Volta Region were prioritized in the list of critical road projects for 2020. As it turned out on page 160 of the budget document, the Volta Region was inadvertently left out. In the event, I'm here to amend Table 21, Mr. Speaker, to include the critical roads in the Volta region as originally agreed on. For the avoidance of doubt, Mr. Speaker, the critical roads for Volta region are as follows. Asikuma have 45 kilometers, have a Hohoi Jasikan 83 kilometers, and Ho Joje, the new 99 kilometers. This, this will not increase the proposed 2020 appropriation because you're already included in the budget estimates for 2020. The Constitution of Ghana and the standing orders of this House deserves respect. Is it an afterthought? Is it an amendment? What amendment? How do we, how do we, add, how do we add the appendix to the budget you so presented on behalf of the President? But Mr. Speaker, since he's providing relief to the people of the Volta region, thanks to the Volta caucus of the minority, we have behaved well in exercise of oversight. You have come here not on your own wishes, but because you are compelled by the political minority to do what is right for the people of Volta region. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker in, this, in this house, in this house, under Dr. Dushuo, a budget was presented to this house, which was full of inaccuracies. The speaker, Mr. Speaker, the budget, the whole document had to be reprinted, and a second version was brought to this house. A motion was not tabled on this house to withdraw, to withdraw that one. Purely because the minority, through the minority caucus in Water Region, took this decision that the minister rightly came to parliament to amend does that really matter as to whoever drew the attention to him? It, it, it matters because I can tell you if we were dormant, if we decided to leave this, it would have remained like that. If we didn't raise the issue, the government was not going to do anything about it. Don't forget some members of the majority were, were, were actually, actually supporting the fact that there were roads mentioned in Volta region already, so that was all enough. Today, the actions of the, the finance minister suggest that he acknowledges that Roads in other regions, Ashanti, Greater Accra, Eastern Region, were mentioned as part of the budget, yet they were included on Table 21.